No, let me try. I tied it. They die again. They die. They die. Oh, that's okay. Is that okay? All right. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, on this wonderful uh, and beautiful day here in the city of Reading, uh, I'm gonna have a few closing remarks. Uh, however, in the interim, I have some amazing individuals that all have been part of this. Uh, 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 project that I'd like to introduce. So first I'd like to um, ask Mr. Tom Gombar from uh, Senator Judy Schwank who called me this morning and told me that she had another commitment um, but however she um, would make herself um, uh, she has from the very beginning um, aware of uh, this uh, uh, event today and I believe Tom would say some additional remarks. Thank you, Mayor. It's a pleasure to be here today, and I'm glad we're under a tree. I brought my hat to cover my head in case we got uh, a little uh, sunburn. But as the mayor said, um, Senator Schwank couldn't be here. We thank the mayor for inviting us, and Councilman, uh, Councilwoman uh, Sahelnik, thank you. Um, we've been involved with this project from oh, many years ago, five, six years ago, when it was kind of just in its genesis of an idea and as it grew and as the community got together, businesses, the city, council, um, Reading Housing Authority and other community partners, it kind of grew. We were able to work with Representative Rossi and then Representative Cal to Jerome to bring some state funding to support this project. Two years ago, it was $725,000 for the multimodal program to help seed this money with some other funding that the city was able to get. Um, it's nice to see um, the project come to fruition and I, I like to use an analogy of sports um, it was started the ball was carried and now the mayor Moran's administration is carrying it over the goal line and this is great to see and on behalf of Senator Th uh, Schwank I'm thankful to be here and congratulate everybody for the progress we've made this far and look forward to seeing this completed this is going to be a great project for everybody in this community uh, now I'd like to introduce Dave Tallarico, president of the 18th Ward Improvement Association. That's right. All right. Thank All right. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wait, we look forward to this day for a long time. Thank you. So I just want to, you know, I, I can't echo the comments enough about the, the amount of cooperation, the involvement, the, the excitement that we've gotten at all levels from the state and the county. Um, the city administration has been phenomenal to work with. Every department, um, you know, when you really get to uh, work with them hand in hand um, through the engineering of it all, through the designs, uh, the, the issues that uh, arise when you're going through the procurement and then finally the award of contract and now construction, uh, it's just very exciting to see it all start. And it's not only just this island project, the city has taken steps to, uh, actually has completed uh, the accessibility for all the sidewalk corners. Um, that's running in tandem with this project. So this is a layer one where we're gonna build infrastructure, we're gonna expand these islands, we're gonna make them connectable um, for a bicycle and pedestrian safety trail. Uh, we want the entire community to use this. This is all about connecting our communities, the 18th Ward, uh, Millmont area, Oak Brook, down through Schlegels Park, and opening up opportunities for people to, um, to get to where the activities are. That's what this is all about. So this layer one project will run right into layer two, which will be the development of the actual pathway that'll lead through the islands. And then we're very excited about starting the layer three, which is the public-private partnership. This is where the private part kicks in and we're forming a committee right now that's going to be designing the art, the landscaping, and some of the amenities that you'll see. Um, and this will, act, this will be a destination. You're going to feel the anticipation of getting from one island to the next just to see what's up there. So very excited. And we thank everyone for their cooperation and their involvement. With that, I'd like to introduce Lucine Sahelnik, Vice Chair, City Council. Yeah. 
thank you everybody and um, welcome to not only the city of Reading but District 1 which is my district. Um, I'm so proud uh, to be kicking off really today with all of the people who are here because it has been a vision of all of you, whether it's Navarro and Wright, the 18th Wonder Board members, our community organizations, our neighbors that are represented here, the city of Reading, and, and so on and so forth. Um, many years ago, we came together to say, what could we do to improve uh, our, our community? Um, and this exactly right here is one of those projects. Uh, where we stand right now is an important gateway. It's a gateway because it brings together the boroughs of Wyomissing, West Reading, and Reading. What we've seen during the past years during the pandemic is a heavy use of this area uh, for people who were out exercising and trying to uh, ride their bikes uh, and enjoying the park systems that are here, the Reading Public Museum, the Arboretum, the Wyomissing Trail System. Uh, into our Schlegel Park systems and beyond. Uh, we also know that our boroughs are all working together on a county level within the Planning Commission um, to make sure that our county is bike friendly and pedestrian friendly. And that means we have a better quality of living. It means that we have safety uh, in our recreation. It also means that we have a better accessibility because many of us also try to walk or ride our wor uh, bikes to work if that's possible. I know myself, uh, I often will take uh, my bike uh, into the city, over uh, the river, into Riverfront Park, um, and I'm sure that students from Alvernia and other residents and people working and living here want to do the same. So as we look at the kickoff of this project, it's been many years and many people working together, but what's most important, it's been a common and shared vision. We want to make sure that we're also improving safety and accessibility throughout our city, and we're doing it with our uh, neighboring municipalities uh, so that we can continue to work on this together. Uh, so thank you for being here. Thank you for, uh, to my fellow neighbors, since I live right across the street, enduring the construction, enduring um, patience, um, enduring um, coming together with a shared vision that really puts all the pieces together. Um, it does take time. It does take a lot of money. It does take patience. Um, but with all those things, we're going to continue to make great things happen here. And thank you for all being part of that. Um, uh, yeah. <laughs> and thank you to all of you. That applause is really for you. Um, I'd like to reintroduce the mayor uh, for some closing comments and then our ability to break ground on this project we've all been waiting for. Mayor? Thank you. Thank you, Councilwoman. Um, so again, good afternoon to everyone. It's definitely a pleasure and honor. Uh, as I stated, uh, back in January 6th of 2020, the city of Reading is open for business. And um, so today is another great day uh, here in the city of Reading. In fact, just last Monday, uh, we announced the beginning of the River Road Extension Project. And here we are today, another city entrance and district embarks in a transformation that will serve the 18 ward community and beyond. Uh, it fills me with great and tremendous enthusiasm to see taxpayers' money invested in developments that would directly benefit our residents and visitors. In fact, I'm also grateful to all the grants that were made possible uh, for projects like this one. Uh, our mission of revitalizing Reading includes our gateways and surrounding areas. Uh, that connect us with our county, the commonwealth, the nation, and the world, okay? Uh, we're going to make sure that everybody knows Reading exists, not only in the Monopoly game, but in true reality. Um, this area will see pedestrian safety enhancements, uh, such as ramps and sidewalks, a bicycle trail, curb fixing, and vehicular traffic patterns. With these improvements, uh, Reading is striving to be a community-friendly place, safer to walk, live, learn, work, and play for residents and visitors in a steadily growing zone that will become an economic, excuse me, economic epic center in our region. I dream big, as well as everybody behind me and here present. I am grateful to the work uh, with in, in incredible work with a vision of improving the quality of life of our neighbors. The plans are, are looking amazing, and the beautification uh, that we will see in this area is even greater. Uh, in fact, I'll dare use the word stunning. Uh, like I always say, we are each other's neighbors, and this is a testament 
to how when the community such as government businesses leaders and authorities come together is capable of achieving greater things I often use the word synergy I don't want to dismiss also in pointing out uh, one individual mr. Thomas I mean mr. Mazzano uh, for always making himself available in this area and beyond uh, in addition to all the partners that we have had so thank you sir um, today the community is the uh, protagonist of this story as they will directly benefit from this project uh, so I cannot say congratulations to the Obrook and the 18th Ward for this amazing project that we're taking upon and it was only available and successful because of the collaborations of everyone here and uh, everyone that has been contracted thank you all uh, congratulations um, to the city of Reading will continue to be innovative will continue to bring projects that are worth it and we will continue to sign uh, whatever contract is needed to make sure that Reading is beautified and improved so thank you very much and with that we are going to do a ceremonial uh, 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 a picture of the project commencement correct all right Thank you again and have a wonderful day, everyone. Where are we going to do this? All right, I'm going to take the bop card. Um, I tried it last week and then it worked. I think it's part of the bop card. Right here? Okay. All right. We don't have to go far. All right. If we could, well, since they're already out here. You certainly need one, sir. Do we want to just. Right here. Right here. Right here. Okay. Well, they might have to come up front. No. Dirty show. Oh, I'm so glad. All right, Mayor. Mr. Mayor gets on. All right. Yep. Um, and then, do you want some of the? Um, do you want some of the board members as well, or do you want the first picture, picture just with her? We could ask us? them. Let John. Yeah. One of the stand up. Are we gonna just? Uh, we have any eight wonder board, board members, members that would, would like, like to, to join us. Part of this? You guys, it's, 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 it's a nice tight shot the way it is. Okay. Should, should we get down there or do you want us up you here? Wanna, I'm going in the hall. Yeah, you, you, you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Oop, you okay? You got it? Yes. All righty. All right. Count of three. One, two, three. And do one look at here? One more. Thank you. I should have told you okay. I'm just posing. I'm not Alrighty. actually posing. <laughs> <laughs> I want to do a real thing. Okay. There's some backfill going on here. There you go. I'll backfill. Really? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you. Yep. All right. Be careful. Do we want, um, do we, do we want some pictures? Of yeah, let's take a picture sure. at least with all the board. Why not? Can we get a picture with all the board members, please? Okay. And uh, Mr. Gilbert, if you could join Thank us. You. Thank you. Please. Let me just go right in front of the... the well, let's go get in front. Take it yeah. Come, let's come in front of the. Oh, we're gonna have to do it front? Yeah, because it's it's. I don't want some of us to hide. Why can't I hide? Come here, girlfriend. There's no hiding. You go in the middle. You're in the suit. No, that's right. There we go. Did we get everybody in? Anybody else that we missed? Stan, why don't you join us? There we go. Come on. We need a model that represents the city. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not it, obviously. <laughs> uh, Stan, you're in? Yes. <laughs> Got it. All right. Thank you. Thanks to Mike. I see you with over with there. <laughs> Barry, Craig, and Jennifer from Navarro yeah. Wright. Yeah. Let's get our engineers in here. Mike, right. Mike. Oh, Mike. Oh. come on. Tim? <laughs> Tim? Where's Mike? Well, Go ahead, you guys. Yeah, he was hiding. <laughs> we'll get With out. all the safety gear on, Tim. I still saw him. There we go. All right, let's angle. Thank yeah. you. Thank you for coming out. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for coming out. No, no, this is short. Okay. Hey. <laughs>